Hello YouTubers and thank you for tuning in today. I saw a very special uh, technological uh, gadget review because do you know why I'm going to be taking a look at this device here. Look what I've got. I've got a new tablet. Woo! This is a Samsung Galaxy A9 tablet that I've actually I've got from my dad yesterday. Uh, I have to say they really do cost such an expensive price. Probably pushing up the £200 mark. Who knows? But hey, uh, this one here is a 64 gigabyte uh, tablet, uh, but it's also got an SD card in it, which can actually hold up to about 314 uh, gigabytes, uh, which is actually quite massive. Oh, blimey, 314, that's actually quite massive somehow. And this tablet is actually quite very, very good. So, as you can see, I've actually started to log in on my tablet. Okay, so I've got pictures of Lum here. This is actually kind of like the same interface as what I had on the previous tablet, which is the A7 tablet. And amazingly, this tablet has been one of the best so far. In fact, uh, the A7 tablet, but this here is the A9 tablet. Now, originally, I was going to be planning of getting an A8 tablet, but this one here is far by like the latest model or the latest. A tablet they've actually produced and best thing is is that well obviously because of the fact that you know there's been a lot of editing and stuff well amazingly what I can definitely say about this tablet is that it's very good and amazingly when you play all sorts of videos uh, obviously like, I'm pretty sure if you play very good videos on your tablet they actually run relatively well and amazingly that the tablet can hold up to about 64 gigabytes in the internal storage. Together with the SD card, that takes us to about 314 gigabytes. That's basically about 250 gigabytes, I think it is. I'm pretty sure it is. Without looking like a total lunatic. <laughs> and it's sunny already. So, this tablet. What's actually very amazing about this tablet is that the way it actually interacts is like if I go into settings here. So I need to show you this very clearly because there's the camera here. And um seems like where my hand is. Let me see what I can do. So amazingly I can also go into settings as well too. It's it's got like a much wider sort of HD screen. I think it can capture like ten A HP videos, but it does look very, very nice. I'm pretty sure it's like the same quality as the A7 tablet that I did in previous videos, of course, with that. Hopefully, I'm going to do the same thing with that kind of device. Now, most importantly, if you look on this tablet, it's also got these, like, what you call them, window keys and stuff, though. It almost acts like a, a, a proper computer. Like, you know, tablets are like computers of the future, touchscreen computers. And there's a look at the... Um, the case as well, and that's the camera. Now, part of it, I just had breakfast, and um, sorry about that. Um, yeah, this is quite a much larger and wider looking screen. So, I can definitely go into Google Chrome and um, I can definitely um, type whatever the hell I really want. There's some, there's some notifications going here, multiple notifications. So, most of the A8 tablet, it's quite a very Amazing device. Actually, I'm reviewing the A9 tablet. Amazingly, this is the device that I've got. It's a much larger device somehow. It's very, very good. It's about 64 gigabytes. It's also very large. Oh my goodness. I love the fact of how large this is. An A9 Wi Fi tablet. It's also amazing. It also. Oh my goodness. That's interesting. I'm just looking at. I think I did a video on on it before I purchase that thingy bob. It also has amazing, you know, bright visuals. I bet you what this one will have expensive bright visuals in it as well too. It's quite good, isn't it? Obviously with that thing. Yeah, you know, the, the A7 tablet, it's a great, great looking device and amazingly it's somehow very, very I have to say it's very nice and large. It's about about eight point something zero MP I wonder what that stands for and also one thing about this tablet the nicest part about this A9 tablet that I've got is that it's significantly straightforward faster than the A7 tablet that I actually had previous months ago which is amazing I'm actually happy and pleased 
that I've actually got this tab within me because you know when I've got this it's actually straightforward helpful to know that uh, hi this tablet can do more so anything than what you know the um, the A7 tablet could have done it's got a much faster sort of uh, performance as well like whenever I select videos another whatnot and stuff it's quite good as long as I'm using it very properly it might be the internet that might cause it to lag and stuff but it's a great device it's a great great thingy bob I can just definitely you know download apps like Angry Birds in general oh my god that's actually quite a very good looking tablet a surprisingly nice looking tablet because why the hell not would it be a very bad looking tablet it's very very good it's pretty much rivalizing and challenging the Apple iPad market it's been a lot of news of Apple monopolizing I don't know, it's been, there's been some very bad news about it. Shockingly deep upon news about it. But, you know, this tablet, it's somehow really, really great. It's so good in the sense that, you know, whenever I play around with this tablet, it's actually really, really good. Can you believe that? This is actually really fantastic. You know, I can actually capture some very great footage. The camera settings are a bit significantly different. Yeah, you know, and also I might try and take some photos. I've also got much more HD video qualities in in a sense. Actually, amazing. You've also got some great settings as well. Not sure if I'll show it to you very properly because I need to probably see what I'm looking at the same time. There's so many different settings here on this tablet, and it's somehow very amazing. It's a great device. As I said, this is a very great looking thing. You know, if I was going to be filming videos or taking photos and whatnot, it's a great looking device. And amazingly it's also got, if I go back to the camera section, if I go towards here, uh, I don't know if there's any more settings, not many settings here, but that's all I could see, hey? And then you can also click on these little nine dots, which are right over here, and it actually takes you into certain apps and stuff. And it's actually amazing, oh my goodness! No fricks, man. They've got Microsoft Paint. Oh my god. That's really awesome. And they've also got this 3D pinball game. Oh my god, blimey. I used to play this damn game. It's so nice. We've got uh, 3D pinball Space Cadet. Oh, that's not fair. But we do have Microsoft Paint in it, which is nice. Oh my god, this is so good. And it's like on the retro style. How awesome is that? Blimey, I love the um, old classic Microsoft Paint. This is just awesome. Hmm. That's very, very nice. Uh, it's a bit different comparing to, like, you know, the Microsoft Paint that I use at home and stuff. This is really awesome. Oh my god. This is like the old fashioned one. Anyways, I should have to probably close that. It's still nice, but if only if it was like the most recent version, that will somehow be very mind blowing for me. Awesome. So there you go, this is the A9 tablet, it's got a much larger screen, a much larger, a much higher quality in camera, much larger sort of design, and also you know the fact that because it's a big tablet, and also it's quite a very good lighter model, uh, it can actually capture some very impressive 1080, 84,096 HP in terms of the quality and stuff, but I'll see about that once I'll try and put it up to the computer and see what it's like. Maybe it won't be as similar as what I had before, but yeah, such a great device. Somehow it's relatively good. I can't believe this. And hopefully, this will be a great piece of apparatus to actually make videos with it, because why the hell would I not? So it's very much well worth of checking it out as time progresses. Anyways, I hope you really enjoyed in this A9 tablet video, of course. Uh, hopefully it's actually, well I haven't made any videos from it yet but please give this video a like, subscribe for more for that videos in the future it's actually quite nice to get the A9 tablet nearly said A8 didn't I, and the A7 because you know it's a much faster tablet and it's also quite large also very good capacity as well 314 gigabytes with the SD card and the internal storage combined together a lot of thumbs ups as always thanks so much for watching and bye for now and noticing I'm actually making this video on a Sunday, uh, how lucky I am.
doing it, of course, 